Hi everyone, um, this is size 10 straight chunk hook and thread I'm using is <coughs> fluorescent orange and um, size is 8 o. so if you just start below the eye I'll explain all the material as I go along Just past the point and between the barb and point, don't need a very long body, and then come back. Basically, this thread I'm using only for a little tug in the in bottom. So, finish off with this thread because this is a little bit chunky buzzer, need a nice body. So I'm using a kind of few wraps on this. So now I'm using a block thread which is uh, <coughs> again 8 o. Keep going. That's enough. And for the body I'm using is a strip quill. This is a one strip. I took it off from the near the eye. So catch it. Actually come back, touch and turn. all the way and now use your hackle plier or use your hand to bring this quill now you have to leave a quite decent amount of gap that's three turn that's enough now but I'm gonna cover that all you need a three turn and catch it secure this and just kind of hide all this image and That's fine. Work with the head. Need a nice size of head here. So once you've done that, you need a cheeks. So this is a buyer cheeks. Fluorescent orange, hot orange, fire orange. You can use different color. Entirely up to you. So keep them together. Cut this end off, put them on either side equally. Again, take your time. Make sure they're sitting nicely. That's okay. And for the flashback you're using a tinsel mirage which is a medium size again and holographic. Catch it on the top. Make sure it's sitting nicely on the either side. If you're not happy, do it again when you're ready. So That's fine. Okay, now bring these both of the cheeks forward. Touch them together. 
secure them. Make sure you take your time. And now bring your flash bar. Give it a little stretch so it sits nicely. Secure it properly and cut this off with a scissor. Just cut one end and then pull it off. Now work with your head. and whip finish. So that's it, your buzzer completed. I'm just going to get some fluff off from the body. So there you go. And some UV resins. Work with it nicely on the head first. Take your time. Just get it first and then see so here you can build up a nice head, you know, and take your time when you're using UV resins if you want to give a nice shape of the to this pattern. Now the head is done and now body which is just thin coat Just gonna put a little bit more on top of the head. So there we have a traffic light quill buzzer. I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.